Activation code Echo Niner on all GI Joe remote stores. Dial up from Map Strike. Prep for action. Communication is reacquired. All games end today. Yeah, you were right to call me in for an ID. Major Sebastian Blood himself. Senior staff to Cobra. Or was. Everything in the armory? Every vehicle, device, and gun duke. Shaped charges designed to do maximum damage. If the flag hadn't been built to G.I. Joe specs, we'd be on the bottom of the Pacific right now. That's not a big comfort to me right now, Stalker. Who was running the security detail this shift? Bazooka. I want him here now. I want to know how someone kicked out our teeth without him noticing. We found him. Not a mark on him. Killed and hidden before the charges were planted. We have a new situation. Satellite communications are down. All of them. Anything involving a satellite isn't working. Anywhere. And something's happening in New York.
It recently occurred to me, however, that if I had all the power, then everyone would bring me all the money. I therefore make the following proposition. You have 24 hours to turn control of your nations over to me, or I begin killing nations until such time as you hand over the keys. Now, obviously, no one's going to believe me, and all of you will attempt to mobilize against me. And so, I illustrate my point. Scarlet? That symbol. It's the mark of the Arashikage, isn't it? The ninja clan that trained you. And Storm Shadow. Storm Shadow killed Bazooka, sabotaged the armory, and now he's calling you out. I know what happens next, and I'm not arguing. I'll signal for a hypersonic transport, but... You be ready when we need you. Clear? Good. Now go. You can go with him, or stay with me. Your call. Make it now. You mean stay with the unit? You heard what I said. Just like that? Just like that. Then I stay. Get him down. Wait, where's his grenade belt?
Satellite communications are down worldwide. We now have enough intel to know that Cobra has done something unimaginable. This is UAV footage from over Moscow. We're looking at a fatality count of around 10 million. Cobra did that? How? A nuke? Not a nuke. But we don't know what it was. Yet. What we do know is that this is the greatest threat Cobra has yet perpetrated. This was planned extensively. Knocking out satellite comms, decapitating a superpower, and attempting to cripple the only team that could possibly mobilize against them. Killing Bazooka. <sighs> Killing Bazooka. Giving the world less than 24 hours to hand over all control to Cobra. But we're more than one good soldier. And we're more than a bunch of guns and vehicles on the armory deck. They've underestimated us the way they always do. We've got less than a day to make that work for us. Go down there, work with the support staff. I want some answers. Here's Wild Bill calling Brussels Hub. Do you copy? I'm issuing activation code Echo Niner on all G.I. Joe remote storage sites. I want all those lovely vehicles dusted off and prepped for action. First, we look at how satellite communications can be killed, but regular radio can work. The interesting thing is that regular radio is also clearly interrupted for a brief period. Okay, well, what does that indicate? We need to run through the possibilities right now. Boys and girls, talk to me about weapons. How do you incinerate a city without using a nuke? In theory, I can think of five ways to do that. How much time do you have? You are my new favorite Joe. Talk fast. What do we know? The ionosphere's been superheated. That means radio signals bounce off it. Satellites can't send down to us, we can't send up to them. At the peak of the superheating, nothing worked. When it settled, long-range radio began behaving properly, skipping off the ionosphere. That bit's real important, because that's how Moscow was destroyed. Those kids down there have collected enough data to confirm Cobra used a particle cannon. They fire it skyward, where the particles are dispersed by the ionosphere. The particles are then recollected over a target of Cobra's choice, anywhere in the world. And boom, death from above. Like a laser beam? Supercharged particles. This is a whole new thing. But the kids have worked out where the cannon is. One of the abandoned Russian missile silos, would you believe? Don't seem right, does it? To set up something like that, they must have been there a long time. There's gonna be major counter-intrusion technology on site, Duke. I know. They'll spot a strike team from 10 miles off. Breaching that place is gonna be a one-man job. Or a two-person unit. Have we got more hypersonic transports on the way? Yes, ma'am. We got one 30 minutes away. And then I guess I'm flying the pair of you to Siberia. And this is how I win the world. This juncture, of course, is usually where the wheels come off. But not this time. Cutting the traitor made your blood's heart in half right in front of you, right here, in this room. Should have gotten the point across. It suited me once to appear weak and cowardly, because it motivated you people to think. But today is a new day. There will be no moves to take over my command. There will be no mistakes. There will be none of your crap. None of it. Work with me, and I will give you the world in less than 24 hours. Work against me, and I will gut you like a fish. through to the New Mexico radar station. Yeah, this is dial tone on the USS flag. 
I'm looking at the latest data you sent over, and there's a string of anomalies, mid-stratosphere. Duke and Scarlet are prepping for pickup, so what now? So we have to start putting the rest of the pieces together. This is gonna take the whole crew, Roadblock. What I don't get is how Cobra is holding the whole operation together. How do you mean? Uh, they've been ahead of us every step of the way so far. We even have confirmation that there was a kill team waiting for Snake Eyes in Japan. They're squirting a lot of information around at very high speed without detection. I know how. These things are barely in prototype, we thought. They're called stratolites. The core is a helium balloon made out of incredibly tough stuff called thermoplastics. I'm guessing Cobra has a constellation of them floating 20 miles up. Hundreds of them. And these can still work with the ionosphere thing that's blocking our sats? They're way below the ionosphere. They've been working this whole time. Tunnel Rat, I know it's a little out of your field, but... I do two things for this team. Diffuse things and blow things up. 20 miles up, you say? No problem. We put a UAV up there. Something on a stratolite locked onto its engine and burned it out of the sky. We have to assume it's an anti-missile system. This will be different. Give me an hour to put this together. But it doesn't solve the real problem. Which is? If we take out this stratolite net, we kill the communication system. But it don't give us our satellite coverage back. We just got that piece of the puzzle. This is HARP, an installation of North designed to superheat the local ionosphere for experimental science. Their phone lines were cut a few hours ago. They've been taken over. There's a research station a hundred miles away. They say they can see the glow of those antenna for the first time. Put together strike teams for HARP and the stratolite operation. It's gonna be one of those days, man. Everyone's up on deck today. Time to go to work. Remember, the first one to speak gets to see two of their friends killed right in front of them. I want lots of peace while this machine we've supercharged does its work. After all, it's not that often we get to spend this much time together. Uncle, may we speak? You should call me Sensei in front of the other students, Storm Shadow. You know that. I do not speak to you now as a student. Very well. You've been tutoring my friend privately. You have been training since you could walk. Your friend came to us as an older child, and often he needs a little help to keep up with you. He is your best friend. Do you deny him aid? No, no. It's just, you haven't taught me the seventh step yet. I do not understand. The seven steps to the sun. The martial arts form you created upon which the reputation of this school is founded. I understand the seven steps very well. I do not understand your question. I am the greatest student in this school. I am your own nephew, yet you have not taught me the seventh step to the sun, the final strike form. Why? You are not ready. How much readier can I be? 
Do you understand why I have not passed the seventh step on? I mean, do you have any inkling? None. It makes no sense to me. You should still be grappling with the implications of this sixth step. Key! This you can already do, and it is a terrible thing. The seventh step is death, passing that knowledge on to anyone. Even my own blood is a huge and treacherous step. You do not understand that to be able to deal utter destruction with only seven blows is a responsibility like no other uncle. You will not live forever. Who will pass on the soul of your school to new generations if you do not teach me the seventh step? This is not the soul of my school. Do you really comprehend so little? Do you really believe I have nothing to teach but death? Your friend is more ready than you. Violence is a burden to him, to you. It is less than air. I ask you one more time. Will you teach me the seventh step? No. I believe I will not. to be ninja, my friend. But Uncle wanted us to stay schoolboys to his will. Now we can make this place into what it should be. If you strike another Arashikage, it's Vendetta. You know that, Snake Eyes.
Shepard decommission the missiles. Follow the cables. Talk to me. Don't ask me how they did it, because I still don't know where Cobra gets its tech from. But if I had to guess, I'd say they turned the warheads into a nuclear reactor pile. Sartin. So here's my cunning plan. Cobra's static stratospheric satellite constellation has anti-missile technology that locks onto engine signatures. So getting up there is something of a trick. Luckily, insane stunts are part of the job description. Project Nanhai in 1955 put a pilot 20 miles up in a high altitude balloon. We're gonna do the same thing. No engine, see? It's gonna take pressure suits, some tight flying, and a buttload of luck. Saves Cobra built into this. Yeah, that's it. I want to bypass that. Get the cover off it carefully. Switching a thermal. There. I'm gonna guess that that's the Baroness and Destro, and lots of hostages. Element of surprise gets us nowhere. They're in an open area. We can't get to them without them seeing us. So how do you wanna play this? I figure we get more traction by letting them know we're here. Outstanding. Wait, I got an idea. To be. Okay, let's do this. Some idiots are going to break in. If we don't like what they say, we're going to start killing you. So start crying now. Make it good. A little honest victim's fear always rattles these people. What? You think I'm gonna knock? What are they doing? Killing themselves. So many years. So many fights. So much hate. I used to tell you that I blamed you for my uncle's death. I only said that because I hoped it might hurt. I used to tell you that it was a matter of honor. That you struck me and vendetta must be observed. 
But that's a lie. I hate you because he was going to teach you all seven steps of his most secret martial form instead of me. I hate you because he chose you. That's all. I had him killed by a Cobra Sniper. But you, all I've wanted for years is to kill you myself. Just like he taught you. But that's all he taught you, isn't it? He didn't teach me the seventh, but he didn't teach you the sixth.
Walk away, Zartan. You were only ever a mercenary. You can walk away now and live to get paid another day. I was a mercenary a long time ago. I still remember the first job I ever did for Cobra. Kill anyone I like, any time I like. I don't need the money. I just need the killing. <coughs> I took a bullet off a rip. Ignore it. Disable the damn particle cannon. That's just cleared it. Any idiot can re-engage it. In fact, yeah, it'll automatically re-engage on remote activation. The way I see it, there's only one way to break it. What's that? I can set the reactor pile to detonate. There's a six-minute cycle in the original warhead systems. Do it. Then bring in the hypersonic transport. Get yourself out. Me? Look at me. It's gonna take me six minutes to stand up. Set it and get moving. The transport will get you out of range before the place goes up. I'm not gonna get out of here in time. Do as I say. There. Done. Now go. That's an order. Oh, the hell with your orders! It's taken me years to sort out in my head what I want. Who I want. And today, I did. I'm staying with you. For all the time I have left. And if that's only six minutes, then damn it, I'm spending my last six minutes with you. Yeah, I know I'm breaking radio silence, but we just picked up signs of activated nuclear warheads. Anything you want to tell us up here? Oh, for Ripcord! Would you get out of here? The pile's set to detonate, and I'm wounded enough to make climbing out of here a pipe dream. Well, how about sliding? I can see a big old hole in the ground that I figure I can shoot a line down. Why you can't hover these things while 10 miles up like Tunnel Rat was hoping for? Down here in the nice thick atmosphere, I can stand right over the silo. I love you. Him, not you. You're a big jerk. Good point. Ripcord, pull! The second I see your eyes, G.I. Joes, I start killing people. So you get out of this building and bring your transport in close. We want to leave in it. Damn. Destro mined the entire corridor. He's probably made the Baroness's undies out of plastic explosives. What now? Give me that gun. Are you trained on this thing? Please, there ain't a gun on this planet I ain't trained on. Give me a G84. <laughs> what are they doing? Just sitting there, wondering what to do. I'll give them another minute. Maybe we should kill one now. Speed up their thought process a little. Nice. Pick one. No, you should pick. 
I hate depriving you of fun. <laughs> Hostages are gone! Oh, that's just bloody cheating. <laughs> Give us an excuse. Go on. this frequency, but I'll give it a shot. I'm also recording this in case, you know, all these stratolites are connected by communications beams, and there are too many of them to take out one by one, but I can make them all kill each other. I can make a massive power surge, ride those communications beams, wireless energy transfer. Hopefully without blowing myself up, but hey, them's the brakes. Rep. Tunnel Rat has disabled the Stratolite network. At this time, we consider Cobra blind and toothless. What now? We make sure this can't happen again. We kill Cobra Commander. Satellite communication is reacquired. <laughs> I've got something really weird coming back from them. What? A sudden energy signature that matches the cannon in Siberia. But that shut down. I know. This is coming from somewhere else. Somewhere in America. Chasing it down. Whoa! What now? Harp effect. Weaker than before, but... But we took the harp installation out. What the hell is going on? Secondary harp system somewhere. Must be. Not as strong as the original, but strong enough. Someone just took our bearings. We're being targeted, Flint. All points. Emergency evacuation. No, 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 no. I got a 
a lock on the signature before we left. It's in the Midwest. A town called Springfield. I hear you. Go to staging areas A through D. Saddle up for a mass strike. You sure about that? Cobra Commander didn't take us out first, because he wanted us to watch him win. Now he's panicking. Now we have the edge. We're going to Springfield. Take a few hours, sir. We don't have the dedicated output of the Siberia <laughs> station. Get rid of this garbage. You nuked Siberia, and all you got was a limp? Funny. Sit rep. Sat coverage is spotty. This new harp clone Cobra's running isn't as good as the main one. Analyzing the original sat take, we figure the Springfield particle cannon doesn't have the same juice as a Siberian one either. If we can take the site in the next two hours, we can stop them from firing again. This is crazy. Can we do this in under two hours? I don't see that we've got a choice. Tell me everything you can about the control systems for the cannon. I figure there's an outside chance I might understand. Just an outside one? on the door anyway. Good to see you. Took care of business?
need some cover! to a plane and out of zone immediately. <laughs> Final report. On our return to the site, the shielded unit Cobra Commander used to hide in was... absent.